So I messed up. It is currently 1.35 p.m. in Dallas, Texas. I have to go to Memphis. I have a bunker biker location there tonight. And then I'm going a little bit further than St. Louis tomorrow. A lot further, like almost to Milwaukee. And then I end up in Milwaukee the next day. Um, I screwed up this morning. There was a lot of rain, so I held off way too much. But let's do it. That's nice, man. Thanks. As you guys know, I normally stop at Bucky's, but <clears throat> not today. We are riding right on through. I got gas at my mom's job, and yeah, let's hit the road. Texarkana. <clears throat> oh, look at that cute little hot boy right there. Get out of the way, lady. God, I got places to go. Move it. People ask me how I entertain myself on these long trips. Well, here you go. Come on, baby. Huh? No. Come on. No. Well, loser. Next, let's see if we can get him. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Nope. Last but not least, just kidding, there's more. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Nope. Pitiful. Pitiful. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, loser. All right, one more. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Woo! He did it. He did it. He did it. Look at these guys as they pass me. Come on. Watch them. They want me to honk, I guess. Currently stuck in uh, stop and stop traffic. What I should have done was go around, go off, put on an on ramp, and then go. But whatever. So we're here. Um, I went through the little side street uh, emergency lane. And before I did another 500 miles, I wanted to make sure I didn't have a hole. So I checked. I did have like a little staple, which uh, re reluctantly slash reluctantly, I took it out. Why? I don't know. But I took it out. And we'll monitor the pressures and we'll be good to go. So, but we're good. We skipped on probably an hour of traffic by going around. I feel bad for everybody else, but whatever. So now we're gonna hit the road some more. So let's do it. Gas stop number one, outside of obviously Dallas. Uh, we went 100 and, let's see what my bike says, 176 uh, miles. I put four and a half gallons, so I still had a gallon left uh, to make it to 200 miles. But we're here, I'm just west of Little Rock, so not even that far, but still, we got a ways to go. So we're gonna get on this bike. I need to go get some, some drinky drinky. Maybe some snacky snacky. And carry on the journey. Don't look, I have my helmet unwrapped. So we're currently in Arkansas Tourist Information Center. Uh, almost Little Rock it says I'm gonna get there at 10:07. It is right now. It is 6:48. Uh, Bunker Biker host. Um, if you ever watch this video, I'm really sorry, but uh, I underestimated the uh, strength slash not strength of my butt, and it hurts. 
been hurting since about you know 100 miles in. Uh, Dave, if you're watching this, I should have bought that thing from you. The wing soft seat. But what did I not do? I didn't buy it. So, you know, whatever, it happens. Um, yeah, see you guys down the road somewhere. Currently pumping more gas. Um, this is gas stop number two, pretty much. It said I had like 40 miles left on the range. It's like, all right, so that sounds about right, honest. Right on the dot, pretty much. Uh, Sexually and physically. I know some people that would agree. So we're currently here at our at the first Bunka Biker house. His name is Josh. We are currently in Blytheville, not Blytheville, not Blytheville, Blytheville. Um, he has a Harley, which is cool. He rides bikes, which is cool. He has a cute little dog named Jojo, which is also cool. Um, but. Now it's time to shower. I'm not gonna give you the full view of the shower, but watch this. You flip this little switch, and it's like a back water kind of thing. I don't know how it works exactly, but it looks cool. Um, yeah, time to get dirty. <laughs> All right, that's it. It's time to leave Blyville and head towards uh, Wisconsin. Um, the plan is to go to St. Louis, see what that's all about. He said this is his only way to get like turns near him. So he's ripping it in the curves. Yep. Ripping it. Look at that. That's a cool like is this the arch? Am I already in St. Louis? What? That'd be cool. Um Oh, is that Missouri? Yep. So we stopped here at the gas station. Um, he wanted to say his goodbyes. Uh, thank you for staying. I was his first person, which was cool. Um, he's a super nice guy. If you're ever in Blyville, Arkansas, give him a call uh, through Bunker Biker. He's really nice. So, yeah. If you've kept up with my recent travels, you know I've been here two times already in the past, like two weeks. I was here to go up to the Winged Rider Rally. I was here to go back home from the Winged Rider Rally. And now I'm here again to go to Wisconsin. We're going up this time, okay? We are going up this time. We're not playing any games. I'm gonna stop, maybe take a picture right here on Walnut Street. Maybe not, probably not. But I have to find parking. I already have a ticket for 1220, I believe. And yeah, we're gonna park in here somewhere. This is a church, pretty cool church. The sign says no parking for church only. Hmm. Let's break the rules. Sorry, church. Oh, look at that thing. Oh, look at that. Well, third time's the charm, I guess. Park in here and call it a day. Hey, me, if you're watching this and they towed your bike, well, they told you so. I could put it right there. Nah, it's okay right here. I'm gonna leave it right there. Please don't tow my bike, whoever's watching this. Please. I have everything. Just don't tow it, please. Give me a ticket, maybe, but don't tow it. My reservation to go up is at 1220. It's 11.48, so let's see. It's hot, it's also fun, so let's do it. It's like the TSA right here. Oh man, that sucks. You can leave everything in it, it's just a whole jacket. Has to come can on. I take this in there or not? Yeah, this one. How you doing in there? Alright, let's go. 
to the museum. What do you want to do? Let's be lazy, Jay. My butt hurts. Let's go on the path. Let's go. Here we go. Here's the museum. I'm kind of short on time, so we're going to skip and go straight to the tram. I'm only short on time because my appointment is at 12.20 and I got to go. So this is all pretty cool stuff. Wells Fargo, it looks like. Here's a how it looks kind of thing. Oh, this is, maybe this is live? I mean, looks live. Look, you can see the hookers. There's one. I'm just kidding. We have to get a patch. I'm not really into patches all that much, but we have to get patches. This is how you cheat the system. Hey, friend, what do you have patches at? Patches? Yeah. Are down here if we have any. Uh, uh, yeah, I think we are. Yeah. This is we're currently in line at the St. Louis Arch. Might take a while, but um, yeah, we're like halfway on the journey, right? We still have at least 500 miles, not today. Maybe like 200 more today, and then we keep going. Um, yeah, it's gonna be a while, but whatever. I gotta go to Milwaukee eventually. I already talked to my uh, landlord, so might be a while, but yeah. So if your group is greater than five, add this link to two. And if your group is less than five, you might be sharing a car with someone else. I'm just letting you know now, so there are any confusion. Does anyone have any questions? <laughs> 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 All right, who's ready to go to the top? I said, who's ready to go to the top? Yeah. Yeah. So I skipped the picture. I don't like pictures. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm okay. I'm not gonna buy it. Uh -huh. Wow. Wow. So let's get in the box. Hopefully everybody brushed their teeth because... Uh... Alright Larry, you're right. It's small. I guess I'll squeeze in the middle. I don't know. Maybe, Maybe you should squeeze right here where I'm at because you're taller than me. Uh, yeah, that'll be fine if you can. Yeah. There you go.
weird question, but can I get in the middle seat and you just put this camera and make it look good? You don't even have to take the pictures. Thanks. It would be cool to go up. Just kidding, I already did. Um, let's go see a tour. Uh, we already did the gift shop. Now it's time to go to the tour. Let's see. Actually, I'm kind of hungry, so this can't be that hard. Let's. See. Alright, let's go. Let's get out of Missouri. This place looks cool, but the hockey team here sucks, so let's go. Alright, so here's the moment of truth. I parked my bike. Um, let's see if I get a ticket. Hopefully not. I'm... There are some people here, but they're all on a Harley, or on like a Harley group going from Nuevo Leon, or somewhere in Mexico. That's what that guy's license plate said. But they're all headed to uh... Milwaukee. No ticket, no ticket. Woo -woo. Well, kind of a funny story. Um, I stopped here at this location in St. Louis to take pictures and my pictures had like poles and like other poles and stuff. So I went to Texas Imports today on Facebook and said, hey, can you guys make something happen and uh, remove all these poles? I'll show you a couple of examples. Boom. Example number one. Example number two. Boom. Example number three. Boom. Or four. Boom. Finally, somebody uh, graciously um, made it happen. And now we have these pictures. Yeah. If you see that thing, if you're watching the video, I just went up into that thing up there somewhere. Let me see where the camera is. Yep, right there. It was fun. It was different, but it was fun. Um, now it's time to continue on. Uh, we're going to somewhere Illinois. But we're gonna make one stop. Five, four, three, two, one, and. Yep. Thanks. This place is kind of dead without a rally going on. Um, Larry, Dave, VZ, are you guys here? I'm, I'm, I'm nervous. All jokes aside, I was in the area, so I had to stop. We're back on Route 66. Uh, yeah. Dave, this is all your fault. You're the one that kind of had it in your little pick. And I was like, that looks cool. Let's go see that. So I'm passing by it, so. So I did go inside and have a hamburger and some fried pickles. It was really good. Um, I highly recommend it. Look at this. I took this picture. Uh oh. Why is that? What, what happened? You said five or six. Yeah, I pushed back a little bit. I got stuck. I, I went to the arch and then hung out there for a little bit and then took off coming over here. Gotcha. So. Yeah, I was going to take you out to Charlie's in the Cove. That's why I said don't eat before you get here. What time is that place closed? They, well, they closed probably at two, but I gotta work tomorrow. Ha! <laughs> Gay! He's ready. Get 
into an automatic, you'll be fine. So we're at Charlie's. Let's see what it's about. Thank you, sir. Question number two. What is the oldest European settlement in Illinois? To this day, it's still a major city. So they're playing trivia. We were late to trivia. It's my fault, but. So we're currently in Peora, Illinois. Charlie's at the Cove. Here in Peora, Illinois. Um, it's a cool place to have trivia on Wednesday nights, right? Today's Wednesday? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. At 7 o'clock. It's a cool little place. Uh, it's right by, what's this? This is, what's the lake or river right here? Yeah. Illinois River. The, Illinois River. Um, the same river that we crossed the last time on the boats in Litchfield. Um, give you a little tour, look at this. That's a shark. It's another shark. That's the same shark. Yeah, it's a cool place. Uh, it's a nice ride to come in. So, but yeah, it's like a cool venue. A nice, it could be like a nice dinner date with a loved one. It could be a whole lot of nothing. Um, whatever you want it to be. The view is, the, I thought this was Peora Lake, something lake, but that is the Illinois River. Sorry, sorry, sorry. That is the Illinois, not Illinois. There's not two of them. Dennis, I'm talking to you. Um, you know, but look at it, it looks great. Now here's the thing though, here's the thing. I feel like dolphins. I don't know what kind of sound a dolphin makes, but whatever. We'll figure it out. So we're in a casino. Not 100% sure if you're allowed to make a video in a casino. Probably